Okay, now you should be able to hear me. <laughs> that was concerning for a hot second. Okay. First things first. Gotta type in hello everyone. That's what I gotta do. Hi everyone. Exclamation point. Sit. Yeah. First comment of the day. Okay, first things first. Uh, we got, we hit 50 followers, so we're doing the face cam, <laughs> yeah, face cam stream, fun times. I have gotten lost in my sugarcane farm because I wanted it to be a big surprise when I, is that the exit? No. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Sassy. Glad to see you. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> this, this is a terrible mistake. Okay, good, good, good. I'm on the right side now. Okay, but I installed Iris, which lets me use shaders with fabric. So now I got shaders. Which, I mean, look how amazing it looks. It's so pretty. And it's like more cozy. I'm just like, mm. And the glow berries are just amazing. The farms, the slight wave to the farms. Oh my gosh, that immediately died to zombies. But then I worked on this off camera because I was like, I'm just gonna zone out and build a giant thing. So now I have this giant, like, wall mural and I gotta do the other sides. <laughs> I still gotta do it on this side and like just repeat the pattern on this side so that way it's not just like <laughs> one side. So it's like, hmm. Yeah. Well, the good news is, is I can use these pillars to go up. I was thinking about putting like a like a floor up there maybe. So then it could like be like a above the statue type deal. But what I really want to do is oh, I like the sky. The sky is nice. And the moon Oh my goodness. Oh, you know where I should go? I like death. Oh my goodness. I should go to um, Basalt Beach and spawn. Because. Oop, too far, too far. Like the grass sways and I love it and like the initial entrance into here was it's just magical and I love it. Okay, anyways, gotta stop getting sidetracked. We gotta go into the nether, into the nether, and yes, oh my gosh, it looks so magical because it's glowy. I love shaders. Like I've had. What is this? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Did they fix? I still haven't fixed the window that they broke. I'll just fix that later. What is this mysterious? A beautiful building, though I fear it may never be used. Never see use. What? I'm pretty sure they had a trial like a couple like last week. It's so glowy, I love it. Oh my goodness. I still gotta switch out the roof on that. Um, this is fine. Let's go to Basalt Beach. This is the way, the shortcut. Um, and it's on the strange book. It's a weird little book and it's very sus. To Basalt Beach because it'll be beautiful. Beautiful. 
I don't know, I say beautiful weird sometimes. It kind of makes the nether actually dark, but like kind of eerie. I like it. This is a different one from the one that I had on season one. Because on season one, I used um, this one called like Seuss. But this one, I believe, is the Vibrant Lights shader. Loving it. The realistic clouds. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That looks cool. The squid. In here looks all cozy and war warm. Loving it. Loving it. Okay. I thought it was going to be night. I think it would be cooler to see it at night. But I think day just happened. Those look cute. I guess. Haha. <laughs> Loving it. The little inchling one. It's... Yes. <laughs> it's an Enderman. Hello, good sir. I like it. Okay. So, I need to go get a bunch of sand. Because I need to make, um, oh yes, this looks great. I love it. I love, it. I love shaders. Shaders are amazing. I'm all like, I like how Minecraft looks. I know it's not the most advanced graphics, but like, I like the feel of like regular Minecraft, but the shaders, man, the shaders are amazing. I gotta get a bunch of sand to make glass. I want to make a bunch of purple glass and um, and what is it? Do, 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 do. Oh, make it look like there's a portal above the temple. Because I'm going to put these big obsidian crystals in the corners. And they're gonna look awesome. So we gotta go back to the bunker. Cause there's an e-chest there. And switch out my pickaxes that I need to heal <laughs> for. I do need to heal the pick pickaxes because I also want to get um, a bunch of glowstone. I think I need something like... It did say online that sometimes it glitches, which I assume what that is what that was. It was a glitch. I need a bunch of sand. Make glass. Um, but I also need to heal up my pickaxes to get glowstone. Just like, hmm. We shall see. We shall see. Okay. Well, let's just fill the inventory with sand and then come back and um, come back. And. Watch that. Uh, then I'll get sand, heal my pickaxes, and then just fly around the nether and get. Oh, that's right, I wanted to go to spawn. Let's go to spawn first. I'm gonna get a bunch of sand eventually. I'm gonna get a bunch of sand. There's no. T There's. There is no boat in there. Vesper running. I'll just bring a boat back with me. 
Um, I want to see how Spawn looks with the shaders, and then I will go to the Colosseum and get a bunch of sand, and then it's a magma cube. Dang, this looks great. I just like how much more fun the nether looks too with the shaders on because like it's more glowy. Sorry guys, I'm gonna just keep talking about shaders over and over again. I also gotta decide what I wanna do for my next follower goal. Hmm. Decisions. Oh, I should visit Lomandi. Do, 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 do. It's on the way. To Lomandi. I feel like it's. I don't like how you can see so much of my bedroom. Curses. Oh well. I will figure that out later. I want to do face cams more regularly. I just don't know how regularly. Because I definitely don't want to do them like every day. But I think like more often would be fun. Let us see him. The man. The one. The only. The man B. <laughs> Look at that lens flare. Well, we gotta go to the side. The side is where it's at. The man B. Alright. Also, like, should I look for a sneaky crystal? I know, based off pirate's clues, uh, that he's in the in a birch forest. But I don't know where what 128 rings is. These are clues that have been giving, they've been giving, and it's just like, hmm, I don't know where that is. Blue fire. We're going to spawn. Because originally I was gonna work on the temple some more. But I need like a bunch of glowstone, so I'll. I don't know. To. Because I want to put glowstone in the floor and stuff. So. Might be doing that. I'm also like, if I got the sand, I could set it up to cook. And dude, look at that. Amazing. We love to see it. The new blaze of embassy. I like how it's dark and cozy. There, there is a crafting table in here. The way that sugarcane looks is good too. We love to see what's in this chest. Gunpowder. Oh, I still can't open those ones. Still cursed. It looks so wholesome. In we go. To the Colosseum. We go. And we gotta go back across. Free boat. Thank you, Ram. I'm pretty sure you get all of the. Um, you get all the glass when you die glass back. So, that should be good. I don't know how much glass I'm gonna need. I just want to get like enough. I'm thinking at least like 10 stacks of glass. Of purple glass. At least that's how much I was gonna start with. And then just like bring the crafting table with me. 
behold the matter mart. Over that way is to a bastion with the magma cube farm that I have uh, souped up so that way it's um you can get magma cubes from magma cream from it pretty easily. Which is good because I have a fire res potion business to uphold and also um you can make magma blocks out of them. So I was like, I'm gonna need a bunch. A bunch of them. So it's like, yeah, genius plan, genius. I keep watching myself talk in the little camera thing and it's kind of weird because I feel like it's off. <laughs> I'm just like, <gasps> no. Here we go. And we got do 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 do. Don't trap don't trap me in there. No. Ooh. I'm top dog. Go in. Let me in. I ran past it. This is the Colosseum. I wanted to add a couple more things before it's officially open, but I'm, I think it turned out pretty good. Yeah. I totally want to see what it looks like on a map. Anyways, enough looking at that. Let's go. Gotta go, gotta go over this way to there's like a desert over this way. So I thought there was a desert, but there appears to be more mesa over this way. Which now I'm all like Oh, there it is. There's that village. That village has like um, a bunch. It has like a good spot to get sand from because it's just a sand mountain. We're gonna get a bunch of it. Don't want to fall into the hole. Now it's time to destroy this sand. Hello, sand. I don't need a beacon to mine you up. And we're all like, I don't like sand, it's cold and coarse. <laughs> Dee, 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 dee. How are you guys doing? Then we run and we collect all the sand. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook like, um, I don't know. I'm going to definitely make a few stacks into glass. Oh no, my perfect plus no longer works. Because if I make a few stacks of glass, turn it purple. See where we're at? Um, maybe I should make like 12? 
I don't know. But that's the other thing. I don't want to run out of glass and then I have to figure out a way to get back up there. Because it's going to be high in the sky. So I'm just like, maybe I should make it all into a purple glass. But then I'll just have like an absorbent amount of random, like, of just purple glass laying around. What was me? Uh, I'll just make it all into purple glass. Or at least half. I'll make half into purple glass. Let's just do 20 stacks. It's not like I can't get more sand for that other project. Yeah. This will be fine. Quite a bit to go. Luckily, it's way faster to get sand than it is to get obsidian or, um, what's it called? In stone. <laughs> yeah. Dee 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 But yeah I'm excited I might get to make my first itsy commission Which will be exciting because um, I made these sugar skull cube bones. Or I made I made a couple of them and I'm trying and I made two. And then I was like, I could make these and like other people might want one and I could sell them on Etsy. And so I made a third one. And posted it on Etsy, and then someone wants to commission me to make a, a 10 inch one, and I was all like, <gasps> What? So that is pretty exciting. Then I'm all like, Hee hee hee. Custom. I'm trying to think of what to do for my next follower goal. I'm thinking like 75 maybe, um, but I haven't thought of like what we would do, you know, or what I would do for it. I've been thinking about, um, doing like an art stream? But I'm not totally sure how that would work. Because I do mainly traditional art, so it's like, hmm, hmm, crochet stream. <laughs> so I don't know. If anybody's got any ideas, well, let me know. I should probably post it on the Discord. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. If any of you guys are Clint Eastwood fans, Cry Macho has come out in theaters for your viewing and enjoyment. <laughs> It's supposedly going to be his last movie, which I just think is crazy. Let's pick up all this sand and see where we're at. Because I'm thinking I probably have enough. 
probably. Alright. Good. Time to yeet myself into some water. Oh no! I'm drowning! Squid! Dude, the water looks so good with shaders. I wish lava was like this with shaders on. Most disappointed. Respond! Bam! Now we're back where I wanna be. This is why I need glowstone. It's that I got a major league mob problem. Let's see. What I'm gonna do is go from like here, right? And do like diagonal. Which would be great. If it only haste always does this, which is annoying. Unless I stand directly on top of it. Then it will only do one. I just want to do like Just kind of help reduce, because I want to do like little stripes of glowstone in the floor to like mob spawn proof it, right? Mob proof, not nah, spawn proof. I'm gonna do like that. Just do a little design, kind of like a triangle thing type deal. And I'm gonna do a couple extra like between here and stuff and it'll look good. And then then I won't stop then I'll stop getting swarmed by like twenty creepers every time I come down to like place a block. Cause that's getting old real fast. <laughs> Wasn't this one? Oh. Okay, let's see. Okay. Let's go set up everything to catch on fire. I figure out a way to get those llamas down. I'm actually thinking about putting in one of those fancy elevators like the Dreams um Dreams base vault place had. I don't remember what it's called. There's an evil layer, I think is what the YouTube video I found on it was called. And I was just like, dang. <laughs> Intense. Anyways, let's grab all the coal and see how much we got just scattered about. Because. This, do do. Okay, and we'll do one, two. Break that up, and then break this up. Do. Okay, and do this. We're just gonna load up our furnaces. All the glass. Too many bows. <laughs> I 
do do do. Phone is buzzing. Okay. Now I add cooks. Let's go down to the mob spawner. Oh yeah, that area will probably look pretty cool. With the shaders. Ooh. <laughs> this is what I was excited about. Oh yeah, I should put back on my clothes. Bam, bam, to the mob spawner. And I'm pretty sure if I stand like right here, that's the perfect spot. Is one to drink the water. Water. Okay. Then we need to put. No, no. Put Color Piercer Heaven's Trail. Is the one we need to heal up. What I should do is go options, video settings, shader pack. Uh, done. Close. Done. Back to game. Oh, whoa, it doesn't have to restart the game either? Nice. So, what I did is I installed Iris, which is like an Optifine alternative. It it's compatible with sodium, so I have iris and sodium. And that allowed me to do the shaders without having having to install Optifine because Optifine right now isn't playing nice with fabric, which is a a huge letdown because um the origin mod is a fabric mod. So it's just like <laughs> Why do you do this to me? Optifine. Fabric. Who is to blame? But yeah. So that's what's going on. That's what I did this morning before I left for work because I installed um, Iris. And put on. And the vibrant shaders. Because I made the statue last night. Well, we can go and look for. I'll either. Um, I'm debating between working on the outside, because I'm almost done with the outside, or. Um, Hunting for glowstone. I think... I think I'd like to have the outside all done before I finish doing the inside part of it. And with the glass, with the sand cooking in the furnaces, if I did the, uh... If I did that, then I would keep the chunk look trunk loaded and they would all get done really fast. So I might do that. I might finish the bones. I do know I have to think of like because <laughs> what I was doing is just going on top of the soul sand except now the spaces in between the ribbing is an even number so now I'm all like I think of something different to do with that and I'm just like hmm what should I do instead and it still look good <laughs> okay 
Well, if I'm doing that, then this is healed enough. I'll go trade with the villagers and get some more, um... What's it called? The glowstone? Because I can get 12 at a time. <laughs> It'll take forever. I'll do that. It's great. Oh my key. I know exactly where things are. I want to put it in the barrels down here and make like a potion potions area. It'll be great. It'll just be full of ingredients and stuff. Do 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 do. Okay. What do we need? Um uh, we need to go top side. And place the ribs. The ribs! When I say ribs, I'm referring to the... The bum. <laughs> will it be night or will it be day? The answer is night. Still looks pretty good. That turned out pretty good as well. It's not like perfect, but I like it. Where is it? Oh no, am I really down to just this many bone blocks? Oh dang, dude. I gotta go get more bone blocks. Can't run out of my main supply. Do we? I don't know. I found out Delta Room Chapter 2 came out today, I guess. Yeah. And I was like, Chapter 2! And I have Chapter 1 on my Switch. I'm just like excited. I'm abating. I'm like, hmm. Debating about playing it is what I'm getting at, I suppose. Definitely gonna play it at some point. I'm just like, should I stream it? Bum bum bum. I don't know. Haven't decided yet. But I have decided. I said I'm gonna do uh stuff. Big yawn. This is how I've been getting up to the upper levels of the temple. And I climb this mountain and then I fly down with my elytra. And it's been working out pretty well so far. So that's good. This is my powdered snow collector. It collects very slowly. Which is annoying, because all the how-tos online made it seem like it collected really fast. And I'm just all like, nah, man. It's slow as heck. Then we go above cloud cover. Up to this little, little tiny peak. And then I fly down. Like the spy that I am. Bam. You cannot get me. Skeleton. And why does this have to be the level that I need to get to? Okay. Here's what I'm thinking. How many are there? There's one, two. Okay, good. That's perfect. So what I was thinking about doing is, so since it's one, two, three, four, five, six, so we got one, two, one, two, three, like that. Okay. And then this. 
this one we keep the same. Which is just right here. And then... Right. Dude, there were not zombies here before. Why are we spawning up here now? Hmm? Just like... Zealous recommended string to keep the snow off of it. Which is a good idea. But also I'm like... I don't mind the snow that much. <laughs> I'm just like, hmm. 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 So, we'll see what happens with that. It's mostly like. But you know, a string would also spawn proof it. So, I'm just like. Should I? I don't know. I plan on putting a giant glass rectangle above it. Oh, my nose is super itchy. Bam. Oh, good. Look. That one's already spaced out. I've gotten a lot better at the haste mining single block thing. So, that's good. I was having trouble with it earlier though, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, because what I've been doing is placing soul sand, and then wherever there's um, soul sand, I am putting the next layer of ribbing, so that way it's like, kind of has a pattern to it, and then when I go through and light all of the soul sand on <laughs> ignite all of the soul sand and then um once i've ignited all the soul sand it looks super cool and glowy and stuff and i'll just be like ooh ominous <laughs> And then we'll look at it with the shaders and it'll be beautiful. Good, good, good. Okay. See? I want to do it. I place the soul sand. <laughs> I go around and place one. And then I make it, stack it up to three. And then on the last one, I go up to the next level. It's very tactical. <laughs> uh... This way, um, then I can just go along the top, and instead of having going up and down and up and down, I can just go all the way across and top them all off, and then, bam. Done. So, that's cool. Huh? It was bad. Because I started doing the the Megma block texturing after I think Tuesday, Wednesday Wednesday stream, and I was watching Jarvis Johnson on YouTube about like bad YouTube channels, and I didn't realize I forgot to let leave the the Discord VC, and then Zealus joined it and was like, I don't know what what happened, but. I'm pretty sure he got blasted with like random YouTube noise and he was like I was just seeing if you were still streaming I was like oh no I'm not I just zoned out and started working on the build and didn't even realize I forgot to uh, leave discord so that was a fun fun moment then we do this do do I don't know how many of you guys are builders in the chat, but I do be building the things. I like building. I think initially I didn't really, like I used to build stuff when I first started playing Minecraft in creative mode all the time, but then I started getting really into survival and just building like 
very nice little bases out of fountains. And then I switched to out of caves and like underground and stuff. And, and then I just started building like other things because I was like, dude, I can build stuff. People build stuff all the time in Minecraft. I can do that. And that's kind of what set me off on the on the building of things. Uh, this one we go, bam. And then, bam. A little intense moment. Go out on the edge. It's never not intense. Then we'll find out how many apart these ones are. I hope it's an odd number because I like how odd numbers look. <laughs> Although at this point I don't think anyone will notice that it's a different number apart. Because I have been doing five apart for every row. I had to mix it up because all of a sudden everything was six apart and I was like oh no. Uh, rethink my design plan. I think it worked out. Maybe? Be okay. Everything's decreasing, so that's good. It's doing what it's supposed to. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> okay. There we go. Do do do. My brother always says my sneezes sound fake, but they are real. I swear. He's all like, you sneeze fakely, and I would. I wish I could just sneeze once. I always sneeze like multiple times, and it's. <laughs> It's a bit annoying. <laughs> Cause I'm all like, people who sneeze just one, like, once. They sneeze one time and then it's done. And then they, they don't sneeze anymore. And it's like, not me. I'm sneezing for like a solid like two minutes. Because I just can't stop sneezing. <laughs> oh, sometimes the block is the place wrong. That is an annoyance. Bing. Did I get everything? Excellent. Now we do this part. Okay. But we're almost to the top, so that's exciting. Then I'm just gonna get a bunch of flint and steels and just go ham. I'll get to the top and I'll just light everything. Okay, good. Okay, how far apart is everything? One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. One, two, three, four, five. Double excellent. Because that makes my job super easy. Dang it. Once it does that, bad Minecraft. This is what I'm talking about. I should be like super careful. Look straight. Oh yeah, if I do, I do like remembered, realized that last night or something. Or, yeah, I think it was last night. I was like, well, if I just stand to the side, then I don't have to worry about like underneath. Here I am forgetting. <laughs> this is good. Hello, sorry I'm like just got back from the ER. Oh my gosh, are you okay? Also, no worries. We're just doing the face cam stream. The ER is hectic. I hope you're all right. Um, but yeah, I'm just detailing the, the temple and I got they're currently off 
because I was all like, I don't need to put shaders on right this minute. But I got shaders working again with fabric, so. Super psyched about that. They look really nice. And I spent a good like half hour gushing about them. So. <laughs> I'm almost done detailing the temple. At least the outside. Once I finish the ribbing, I can go back down and show you the inside and what it looks like from below. And then I'm gonna get flint and steel and light all these soul sand on fire. <laughs> on fire soul sand. Oh my god, doo doo. This one. <laughs> We're all ER buddies though. Cause I also recently did. I'm fine. I was being stupid because my cousin jumped off her bunk bed, the second one, and I said I bet you can't do and said, I bet you can't do that. So I said, yes, I can. And I did it, but I sprained my ankle. Ouch. Well, it's bad that you got hurt, but like also good that it was only, or only just a sprain instead of a break, because a broken ankle would be a lot more of a mess. Do you have to use the crutches? severely bruised my foot by dropping a rock on it like a big rock and I had to use I used crutches for a couple of days because it was so badly bruised I couldn't put any weight on it so I could see where they're all like they're either like uh, I feel like when you have a sprained ankle they're they're either um just ice it or they're like here you go and they wrap your foot like super like a ton and then they give you crutches and they're all like figure it out Yep. Okay. I would suggest if it, they say like it's not supposed to go up into your armpit. So if it feels like it is, um, I adjusted the, um, what's it called? The hand part of mine, because I was just like, she said it shouldn't be going into my armpit. And yet that is all that it's doing is in my armpit. <laughs> it just has those little wing nuts and you can unscrew it and then just move it. It is a little hard to move the bar but and put it back into place but I found it worthwhile. <laughs> Also, welcome to the stream, and I'm glad you're okay. <sighs> Gotta watch out for cousins. They're very good at, at egging people on. Oh, hot sauce? No! That's not good. And up in your- oh, that's terrible. Cause like, I feel like, um... When you eat the spicy foods, like, you get- a lot of times I get like runny noses from the spicy food. So I can't imagine just having it in your nose. It would be very uncomfortable. I hope that it was mild or just weak sauce and not like, you know, something crazy hot. Sounds just like a rough day. Hopefully tomorrow will be better, right? <laughs> then we go over here. And then we do bam bam. 
Bam, bam. Okay, now we got two more little corner ones. Now I'm just gonna remove them because there's literally only four spots that can happen. I'm excited because it's all coming together now. Yeah. I spent most of my today today yelling at children not to sneak into like skip the line at the box office because I was selling movie tickets and we have these ropes to do inside box office and they kept ducking under. No, it was extra red hot sauce. No, that's misery. Oh jeez. Not super hot, hot sauce. It's just like... I feel like you get a little sneak peek of what's inside every time I hit a block. I'm always afraid I'm gonna fall into one of the little holes. I don't even know. I don't even know what to do in that situation. Because usually I'm. I know when you get in your eye, because I know from personal experience what to do in the eye, is to run underneath cold water. But in your nose, it's like you, c you can't run your nose under cold water, you'll drown! <laughs> Which is a little bit dramatic, but like also kind of true because um, your nose does attach to your like throat and stuff, so it's like, hmm. At least me and my little tiny grandmother are going to the cafe tomorrow. Ooh, fun! What type of cafe? Is it the Rainforest Cafe? The Rainforest Cafe is super fun. I sound like a child. But it's true, <laughs> I love the Ring Force Cafe, and when I, I'm just all like, oh man. There's one in Galveston, which is a beach in the Gulf of Mexico, that I want to go to because they have like a ride outside of it. I always am all like, I want to go to that ca Rainforest Cafe, but we have not. Someday I will go to it. Realistically, I bet it's like a French one with the fancy pastries. I gotta love tiny grandmothers coming in clutch with the fancy or with the cafe trip. So cool, it's gonna be all glowy. Oh yeah, this is gonna be clutch. I feel like it's gonna be a Good one to do. And then just the very top one, which will have like one, and then uh, then it'll be all done. At least the outside will. And then I'll run down and go get some flint and steel to light all this soul sand with. Um, okay. So those will connect here. It's like a little spot in town and I'm in the in the town that I'm in and it has breakfast and the best coffee and of course I'm getting a mocha with the roasted marshmallow syrup. Nice. I don't know what that means exactly, but I imagine that it is good coffee. 
And I mean, anything with roasted marshmallow syrup, I mean, has to be like top tier. Like, there's just, there's just no way around it. I don't drink coffee myself. This is why I know nothing. <laughs> But it sounds yummy. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> it keeps placing them the wrong direction, and it's kind of like me on my nerves. But it'll be okay, because I'm almost done. <laughs> Here I was, thinking I was going to run out of blocks and only to find out that I have plenty. So that's good. There we go. There we go. Okay, it's coming together. It's coming together. Yeah. It's like a mocha with a hint of roasted marshmallow taste, and it's my all-time favorite. Nice. What? Wait a second. How is this possible? All the other ones were fine. How is this one too far? Oh, because I built it wrong. Haha. <laughs> Like, why is this one off? Well, there goes that soul sand. That's okay. <laughs> I feel like roasted marshmallow as a scent and flavor, like, are just great. Because, um... I think... Yeah, I got, um... It's like mint and chocolate. This Bath and Body Works lotion that's like... Coconut roasted marshmallow chocolate mint scent. It's it's uh it has a much more elegant name than that, but um it smells really good. And I have to stop my puppy from licking it off my legs because she's just all like, mm, it smells good. I should put it in my mouth, and I'm all like, no, do not do that. It is my lotion, and she's like, mm. I'm just like, oh my gosh, you gotta stop this. She's uncontrollable and small. That's not, she's very controlled. She's easy to wrangle because all I do is pick her up, and what she's gonna do? She's 12 pounds of floof. A very lucky 12 pounds of floof. Do, do, do. Oh my goodness, this is exciting. Wait. Okay, good. I was like, <laughs> check that side. Make sure I'm not just about to... E. There we go. And then... I feel like I need, um... Like to break these ones? Also have a syrup available: caramel with white chocolate, ras caramel, white chocolate, raspberry, blackberry, French vanilla, and others. I forgot. Dang, that's a lot of options, dude. I wish that like, cause I like hot chocolate. <laughs> cause I am basically like that. I don't know. Um, 
I wish they have syrup options for hot chocolate because it's just like people who drink coffee get all these options and I'm just like I would like to put um, raspberry in my cocoa please my mom actually has taken to um, buying the coffee like creams <laughs> and then we put it in our hot chocolates that sounds like so many possibilities. The possibilities are endless. Okay, I need a slab for up here. <laughs> Looking good. Now we gotta light everything on fire. They also have hot, really good hot chocolate. Excellent! It's hard to find good hot chocolate places because they're just like, there's no demand for it. And I'm like, there is. I keep getting murdered every time I come in here because it's so dark. I'm just like, I'm being murked. Someone help me. Oh, jeez. Just got double fill zud. Okay. I need oh yeah this is the inside I made this giant thing and I need to make the other side still uh, it's just gonna be the same but on the other side uh, so that's exciting <laughs> this is why I need glowstone We'll go get that here in a second. Or not. I'm like, I'm just gonna go get glowstone. I'm gonna go glowstone hunting is what it is. I know I have a slab in here someplace. Is it in here? Yeah, it is. Perfect. Okay, now let's go get flint and steel. I need a bunch of them. You got filzed. I know! It's bad! They just come out of the, like, the woodwork, and it's like, no, they're just everywhere. It's rough stuff. Uh. Um, I got two emeralds. Let me see if I can find tin pumpkins while I'm looking for flint and steels. That doesn't have flint and steel. This is flint. Is flint and steel. Thanks. Okay. Oh, I forgot to check. Um. I was looking for iron. That's what I was looking for. Just a second. Is this an organized road? It is an organized road. Which means... Yeah, another flint and steel! But these ones... Start getting chaotic. Okay... Nothing here. Oop, there's an iron. These ones have terracotta in them. They're half organized. Because these back ones are just a big mess. <laughs> My grandma has an Elvis pillow and it is staring at me. Help! No! Turn him around! He cannot look to you if his back is to you. He's giving me a side eye. No, that's no good. That's no good. You must turn him so that way he cannot see you. It's the safest route. Bum, bum. Okay. Actually, I think the other iron might... 
be in here. And this one. There we go. Bam. What do I have? I don't know if I have diamonds in here. Dang. This is my ore shop choker. It is turned around. Very good. Now he cannot stare at you. I named all my shulkers matter boxes and I gave them numbers. I'm trying to think of what else I needed. I needed flint and steel, which I now have. I got a slab. I, I think that's it. Okay. Okay. We'll go back topside. We're going up. Oh yeah! I broke my nail down to the nail bed a couple days ago. It was bad because it was cracked and I was trying to like take it off cleanly but I was in the car and then my mom hit a, hit a speed bump and I ripped it down to the nail bed and I was just like oh and it wasn't all the way off so I used our, uh, our car safety scissors to take it off the rest of the way so that way it wasn't just like gonna make things worse. It was a very traumatic experience but I'm okay. <laughs> I had to run into Target and buy band-aids because we didn't have any band-aids uh, in the car. And I was just bleeding. Good times, good times. I gotta, I hope I can land on there. I think I can. If not, I'll just take down one of the pillars and like climb back up, I guess. I think I can get on there. Or at least close to it. Dang it. Okay, well we got pretty close. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, there. We might also go shoppy, but eh. Fun, fun. Is it? Oops. Is it eh because you don't want to go shopping? Or because your grandma's like. You must only buy these kinds of clothing. And you're like, but grandma, other clothes. feels that I should prepare for war after constru constructing a large monument. I don't know. I think it's okay. I'll light all of these. I wish that getting touched with the lava would like them, but this is not the case. Which is a disappointment, to say the least. Do, 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 do. Bum, ba -dum, bum. Bam. 
my grandmother's dearest is a hair bit picky. Gotcha. It happens. <laughs> My grandmother used to get me clothes that, like, were not my style in the slightest, but were very much her style. And when you're 12, your style is not that of a seven-year-old woman. And then... And then she stopped doing that and just going shopping with me and my sister instead and letting us get what we want. Which I think ultimately was the best, de best decision. I think... Like, my mom or dad told her, like, you know, they're, they're not into that style of clothing. Oh, no. What? <gasps> Look at this. Please have... Okay, good. Like, panic. Panic, the soul sand is gone. <sighs> I hope soul sand melts the snow. This, well, this one literally only has it on the snow. On the soul sand. Do do. It's like dude. I'm pretty sure I won't catch the bones on fire. That's a very confident, pretty sure, by the way. <laughs> but also, like a teensy bit worried that it will. I just remembered that I put bones in front of all of the soul sand, so when I panicked, that made no sense. They're literally labeled. Once I saw a Minecraft bee plush and said, oh look, a bee, I love it, and then she said, no, never. It looks like a rat. What? Well, that's just nonsense. The What? <laughs> I don't know. My grandma needed to have her cataracts, like, fixed. Uh, I don't think she ever did, though. <laughs> um, because one time she came to our house wearing these, um, I don't know if you ever did, like, the the homemade hot pads. They're made out of, like, that multicolored, like, little band stuff. Uh, but she once came to our house and like wearing shoes that looked just like that and she's like I just love the color and it was like they were like uh, they weren't very good looking but her just all like okay grandma I don't think that the minecraft bee looks like a rat <laughs> it doesn't have a tail my uncle used to say that my dog looked like a rat, and I was always really agitated by that statement because he didn't look like a rat. He looked like an adorable Sheltie with intelligence that no rat could comprehend. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Alrighty. Now we do the only sensible thing, which is go escape, options, video settings, shader pack, enabled. Done. Close. Done. Back to game. <laughs> Alright, now we gotta do, do a big flyover. This is gonna look great once once I get all the glowstone floor in. 
to the top of the mountain. I go to F1. Oh yes, perfect. I don't know why, but my grandma has her eyebrows shaved, so she uses eyeliner to make eyebrows, which aren't even eyebrows. They're just lines. That's unfortunate. Next year I'm gonna be like, and she dyes her hair red, which is like a staple among some some grandmas. Just like no anything but that. <laughs> Because it's like a, it looks like a bad natural red instead of just like straight up red. I don't get shaving your eyebrows and then drawing them back on every day. It seems like a lot of work. Alright. Let's do this. We'll do this in cinematic mode. So that way it looks extra beautiful. Alright, here we go. She has pure white long hair. Okay, good. There's still hope. Let me check this. Oh, yes, that looks good. That looks good. I wish the llamas weren't there and the zombie, but that's okay. Oh, jeez. Freaking shader packs, man. They look amazing. I love it. Let's see how our uh, what's it called? Our glass. Glass is coming along. I know words. Ha 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 ha. Man, I love the shaders. That make my eyes feel tired, even with sunglasses on, which is low-key concerning. But I like them all the same. Okay. Keep messing with it. It's great. It's great. Oh, I remembered to add the face cam to the to the end of stream board as well, so that way I can actually wave. E at the end of this stream. Now what did I come in here to grab? Hmm The glass <laughs> Excellent. Bum bum. I hope this is enough. We will find out. Okay, good. Okay. First order of business. Obsidian. We gotta make the obsidian crystals. Um, which I believe is in this one. Okay, good. Second order of business. We need to get eight lava buckets. I think I'm going to head out and sleep. Bye, matter. Bye, error. Have a good, good rest of your night. Sleep well. Let me switch hands. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> I think it's flipped, maybe. Of course it's flipped. <sighs> I don't understand how cameras work. 
Well, thanks so much for stopping by. See you next time. Feels it again? No. Not again. Not again. I've eliminated the child. Okay. We will do this. I believe what I decided to do was go. One, two, three, four, five out. That's the wrong corner. I want to at least place it so that way. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, good. I'm going to place the spots for my corners. And then. Did I count that one or did I not count that one? Oh no. This is how you end up with lopsided. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I didn't count it. Okay. <gasps> Wait! The shadow shows the shape of my texture pack? Oh, that's so cool. Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay. That's one, two, three, four, five. Very good. To the next corner. Because I need them to be 70 high each. Okay, so from here. One, two, oh jeez. Okay, so we go one, two, three, four, five. Then we'll make sure one, two, three. Four. Okay, good. This section will probably get destroyed. Ah, nuts. No. No. One. Okay, that's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Of course. Hmm, that's fun. This is fun. Because I know that <laughs> I want the ones, them to be like 70 blocks in the air from, um, you know, where they're leveled with the temple. I think this one is. That's good. So we just need to get like a 64 back. Get 64 back up in here. It'll be fine. <laughs> I think. Maybe. <laughs> I've got crystals to build, man. Do do do, which is an odd statement to make. Hello, sand. I will take you. Let us go to the spot where I will be constructing obsidian crystal. I need to get um, the lava buckets. I need two of them because I am going to leave a spot where the lava can flow out of and just look really cool. It's gonna be nice. Do 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 do. I got 
there's one. There's two. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, jeez. Of course. Okay, good. Perfect. Okay, now we can squat. Okay. Then we go up. I just want to build the first obsidian crystal. So that way I can like have proof of concept basically. And I'll also know how high to make them. All of them. Going up. And we're almost there. I mean, it's six. Okay. Perfect. Okay. This F3 is 150. Okay. Oh, dang, it tells you the calling. That's crazy. Okay, next, we need to construct said crystal. We go one, and then we go. Actually, I think what I want to do is, no, I do want these. Okay, good. Okay, then this one, this one, like that. These go like that. how I designed them. They kind of look like squares. This is fine. I think I actually have a shovel. I think it looks alright. They look a lot smaller up there, but I think I get their point across. Now I just have to mine it before the lava beats it down. We must gather, gather quickly. stuck down here. I want to add a fog lake into the nether. It's gonna be great. I'm so excited for it. Nice. Okay, so they've made landfall. Very good, very good. 
くですね。Hang on to down there. Dude, I'm gonna sparta you into the lava if you're not careful. All right. Well, we got one of four put up. Let me see if I look at it from a higher point if it looks less just big and blocky. And then we'll wrap up stream. Yeah. Stream pog. Up here, up here, up here, up here. You better leave me be, spider. Well, hmm. Yeah, I'm probably gonna take at least the corners off. Uh, some of the layers, not all of the layers. Okay. I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> but in the meantime, we're gonna go into the stream. All right, thank you guys so much for stopping by. Greatly appreciate it. Um, have a good night, good morning, good rest of your day, whichever one it is. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>